Hello my beautiful friends, it's Living Rainy channel and in today's video I want to share with you some DIY antiviral antibacterial hand air foam sanitizer and uh, at the beginning it's important to mention that most of natural hand sanitizers serve antibacterial purposes. So in today's video I want to share with you some recipes for antibacterial and antiviral sanitizer by using essential oils. Essential oils are natural alternatives that can help eliminate viruses with minimal or no damage. Which essential oils are the best for killing a virus? I would say peppermint, thyme, rosemary, lavender, pine and eucalyptus. For my hand sanitizer, I would love to use thyme essential oil, but unfortunately I don't have that one. If you do, please use that one. I encourage you to use thyme oil as it's the best when it comes to kill cold or flu viruses. It's also one of the most effective essential oils against respiratory infections. So it's very, very powerful. So I don't have that one. Instead of thyme, I'm gonna use um, tea tree oil. It's a very strong essential oil as it comes for antibacterial, antifungus. Uh, purposes. Another essential oil I'll use is eucalyptus. It's another great antiviral and antibacterial essential oil. And another essential oil I will use today is peppermint oil. It turns out to be good for more than just for candy canes. Peppermint oil has shown to significantly inhibit viruses and bacteria. Another ingredient would be uh, aloe vera. It moisturizes your skin. In my case, I didn't have the gel, so I'm gonna use just the plant. I kind of scoop the gel inside and I try to mash it together with the water. Another ingredient for our hand sanitizer would be witch hazel, and it works great as antiseptic and it helps to blend all the ingredients in and makes it very easy to apply. And finally, vitamin E, it softens the hands and has natural preservative powers. So we will start by simply mixing all the ingredients into a small bowl. Fill your bottle, spray with one and a half of the way with cool filtered water. In my case, I already put some water in a bowl with aloe vera gel. Mix all the ingredients together and using a small funnel if you have one, if not, some careful maneuvering if you don't, and then please put all the content of your bowl into the remaining one and a half of the bottle. Please don't overfill. Place the top of the spray bottle and give it a good shake to mix everything together. This recipe makes about 4.5 ounces and can be half to doubled, but should probably not be made in bulk due to lack of added preservatives. Another very simple one ingredient sanitizer would be colloidal silver water. Actually, before the discovery of antibiotics, colloidal silver was a popular antibacterial treatment, so it makes it perfect sanitizer. You can use it as hand sanitizer, you can sanitize your cell phone or computer. Put some essential oils into your diffuser, drink something hot, listen to nice music, stay healthy my friends, and I will see you in the next videos. Bye!